Hi, this is Tim from Morial TV and Morial Radio here with James Jacob Prash live via Skype uh, in England. Uh, Jacob, uh, Believer had a question based on Matthew 24, 34. What generation will not pass away before all these things have happened? Again, we have a teaching tape called This Generation. And we look at the three different terms of generation in Greek, uh, or the three different meanings of the term generation in Greek. The Hebrew term is dor, dor, dor le dor, generation to generation. And it's usually tabulated to be about 40 years. Part of the problem is some people take this Hebrew concept of dor le dor, generation to generation, and make that the Greek <coughs> New Testament definition alone, when in fact that is only one of three possible definitions. The second definition can mean of the era, and the third again of the kind, of the era or of the kind. For instance, right now with the F-22 and F-35, we have the fifth generation of jet fighter planes since they were first developed in the Korean War era. We have the fifth generation of jet fighters. We can speak of the next generation of supercomputers, the next generation of, um, of satellite technology, the next generation of something. That is the second meaning. And then, of course, there is not just of the era, but of the kind. Jesus commences the Olivet Discourse in Matthew 24, Luke 21, etc., speaking about the events of 70 A.D., of 70 A.D. Remember, there were people who would have been there alive at that time, perhaps in their late teens, early 20s, okay, who would have survived until 70 A.D., who would have been there and not completely passed away. So it did have a literal meaning in the Old Testament sense of dor le dor. At the same time, the meaning is not mutually exclusive. We are the generation of Jesus. For instance, in Isaiah 53, it says of him, and as for his generation, who has declared, speaking of Christ, of his death and resurrection, and Isaiah 53, Ishael Nun Gimel, as for his generation, who has declared, we are the generation of Jesus. The era of the church will not pass away until these prophecies are fulfilled. Yet, there is a specific local time-bound meaning concerning the events of 70 A.D., and those believers in Jerusalem who would live to see it. The Apostle John was still alive in 70 AD. Thank you so much for your question. My name is Jacob Prash. God bless. Thank you, Jacob.